Hey Cashers, Derek here, Big Six Clan. In a previous video, I mentioned about making a teamwork cash. Well, today, we're gonna make it. Let's get started. So one of the few attributes that it's really hard to get is the teamwork cash attribute. And so I wanted to create a cash that you would require not just one, but two or maybe even more people to actually get access to the logbook. And that's what we're gonna be doing today, is making that. Now I've already got my birdhouse already cut out and all my stuff that's going into it for the compartment is already painted and primed, ready to go, because I don't wanna to have to come back in and paint this later. So what we're gonna be adding into this once we get our compartment set up is that we're gonna be using one of those cabinet latches, the automatic ones that we're gonna be hooking up a battery to. And we're gonna be using a bunch of different momentary buttons that we're gonna be adding into this cache. So you're gonna to have to push all the buttons at one time to be able to get into it. But it's really simple wiring. But the first thing that we need to do is that I need to build the compartment where the logbook's gonna go and that front panel of where those buttons will also go. So let's get that started. All right, so now I've got the compartment in here where the logbook's gonna be housed, and I've already got the, the latch in there. Now, one of the things that I did do is that I put a larger hole in the top of it for the wires to come out, because if I ever have to do maintenance to this cache, I'm gonna have to come in through the top, and I left that hole there so I can hit that latch to be able to open the store if I need it open. Now, I'm gonna have security screws that are gonna go onto the top of this to actually hold down the the roof on here so you can't get access to it really easily. And right here on the front here is where the panel that I have here is gonna go right here on the front and that's where the other momentary switches are gonna go here on the front. So you will not be able to get access to it back here in the back except through the top. And that's why I left that hole there that size so I could get in there and hit that latch. So the next thing I need to do is to come in and put in all the momentary switches into the sides and into this panel. All right, so now it's all together. Got the top on and got it all in place. The door's on, everything is together. And I am requiring that you bring a nine volt battery to power this. So you have to bring a nine volt battery, but you put it in and then you gotta hit the buttons. But hey, you know what? I don't have enough hands to hit all the buttons because I have four buttons on the inside and four buttons on the outside, but the buttons on the outside are on the opposite side. So this is a teamwork cache, so I need some help. Nikki, can you help me out? Can you be part of my team? Yep. Okay, come on in. Okay, let's see here, okay? One, two, three. All right, and there it is open. Thanks, Nikki, for being part of my team because I could not have done this without you. You're welcome. All right. So really easy and fun to do. Now, all of this 
the buttons and all that is really easy to wire up. It's just a basically daisy chained all the way through the linket. Now, if you want to see how that wiring exactly is done, go check out the video up here in this card up above me. I hope you enjoyed this. Now, this is really fun. And the latch and the momentary buttons are down in the description down below. There's links there and those are affiliate links. So if you get those, that really does help the channel and I really do appreciate it. Hey, leave me a comment. Let me know, what'd you think of this? Is this some type of cache that you would really love to find, especially since it's a teamwork cache? So let me know, so leave a comment down there below. All right, don't go anywhere. Go check out another one of these stories just right over here and find the story behind the cache.